Let's save up. And get this thing rolling. Oh look, it's Angelo. Let's follow Angelo. Yeah, it is. Huh. Here you go, get Rhinoa. Okay. I don't know. Hey, what's up, lady pants? Yeah, yeah, so what? No. That'd be a pretty cool final boss, though. They should have done that. Oh, damn. Sorceress Knight. Now he understands the romantic dream. No. No. Stop it. <laughs> it's okay if it's you. Nobody else. That's enough. Sorceress from the future. There's got to be a way. No, that's stupid. Those words. Come on, Squall. Squall. <laughs> you don't get it. Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Did you ever forgot? <laughs> okay. Dang. Just a dream. Nope. I'll be here. Why? <laughs> Why? What is that? What? Oh. I'll be waiting for you. If you come here, you'll find me. I promise. For sure. Whoa! <laughs> it's not like we're like making a porno, man. Okay. The guy we spoke to his name's Kiros. Huh. Alright, if Kiros is doing it, I'm all in. I'm all in. 
Is he still wearing that weird, like, jumpsuit thing? Oh, hey, what's going on? That's nice. Can I pass you? No? Okay! See ya! Oh no. Oh, your story's gonna be beginning. Okay. Uh, yeah. I encountered a sorceress on the verge of death. I received her powers of my own will? Could not let her get to them. Oh. Okay. There is an end, no matter how painful it may be. Even though it may bring tragedy to others. Well, that's touching. I guess. No matter how tragic everything will be, I must fight. Good enough for me. Uh, now our party's all messed up, which I don't, I don't know why that is. Let's get her out of here. What, what the hell? What'd you do to my party? Freaking jerk. Now we go to Estar and we're gonna go hang out with our bro Kiros. His wicked braids. Blade hands. Hey guys, I'm drunk and I'm driving a Ragnarok! Wow! From the air station, you want to go north because uh, we're headed to the presidential palace. Which, you know, other than story things, we have to get the squall card. Which, well, you'll see. We're gonna get it from. And then after this, we have to go back into Lunatic Pandora. I don't know where this is. Is this, uh... Is this where the palace is? It might be. I don't remember, actually. Yes! I mean, this city is like a maze. It's very hard to understand. Look at these guys. They're in, like, combat positions. I notice a lot of uh, common sounds. After you hear a lot of common sound libraries and stuff, you realize that everything in the world uses the same sounds. You can hear them all the time. Please, this way. This way, you mean? Okay. Where is he waiting? Well, certainly not this way, big fat liars. You meant this way. I see. We're gonna meet this president. I think we already met him once on, uh... The lunar base, but he was in a spacesuit, so. His identity, a mystery. Hey, we can go through here now. That's cool. Aww. Why is he not wearing the goofy robes? Holy shit, what was that? What is up with this country? <laughs> it's something. Been waiting to meet you guys, huh? 
So, this is weird. Like, he realizes that we went back in time with him. Because, like, now his reality is the fairies were with him, and that's us. Like, she did change the present. You know? See? They changed the present. She did it in some weird little way. What do you want to know? Cards. <laughs> Card games. Let's talk about cards, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Okay. There we go. We got our boy Squall. Squall. Only one more card to get. And that'll be on disc four. So what's up with you guys? Oh yeah, you don't talk. He says to relax for a while. <laughs> you speak in ellipses, I see. Uh, where's alone? I see. Oh, okay. So he rescued her before she died. Okay. <laughs> Ten years. Boy. Well, so you guys reunited recently, then. She's in the... Oh, really? Oh, man. Magnetic Pandora. Tell me about rain. Aww. Man. No. You were a silly Galbadian soldier. I didn't like your attitude at all. Then you changed after you went to Windhill. Then Alone was abducted by a star, and you went on a journey. A journey to get Alone back. You wrote articles and appeared in movies. You were trying to find a way to get into Estar. You somehow got into Estar and rescued Alone. Why are you the president? But of course, that wasn't the end. It's a country ruled by sorcerers Adol with ingenious yet inhumane Odin. Okay. Both of them were interested in alone. We couldn't have just packed up and leave. Huh. I don't know. I could have. What the fuck? Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> it's 
Seal, yep. Well, Edo's back now. So, that didn't work. Two issues came up. Stopping the crystal pillar from calling monsters. Oh, that's what happened in Centro. That's why it's a, a wasteland. I get it. Freeing Estar from Adel's hands. Based on his brilliant ideas. Full of brilliance. So Odin is uh, just doing what Adel told him. Well, you know what? That doesn't give you an excuse, buddy. They were just doing what Hitler told them, too. Yeah. <laughs> Look at how they Oh, mighty Adel! Man, is Adel this stupid? Can't get over there. That's a woman. I just don't see it. Realized it was a hologram, but it's too late. The plans are always perfect. Okay. So it was that easy? Really? Yeah, I guess. Decided to send her to space. Oh, it didn't work out. Oh, Ragnarok. So Ragnarok did this. I see. Oh, many Ragnaroks. <laughs> Plus, giant blade. They have arms? What the f <laughs> Oh, man, they got sick Ragnaroks. Why don't you just launch them with the device and not have to fly and grab it? I don't... Fierce debate. We should govern the country after Adel's gone. Well... Rain died. She was sent to an orphanage. Yeah, you would have, jerk. That's a dick move. Who cares, man? You put a sorceress in a fucking space. You know, should have gone back. Should have gone back. Anyways, Ultimecia. Straight to the heart. You mean after talking to everybody? Oh god, Odin, man, shut up. Comes from the future to possess the sorceress of the present day. Leaves her body in the future and sends her consciousness here. Yep. She 
Sure. For the sake of our viewers. It's because of you. Wow. Way to go. There's a machine that imitates it, and you are the one that made the first model of that machine. And it's in the future, right? I see. This is some real fucking Marty McFly shit. From that machine, then she went back. Okay. Yes, you can! <laughs> you want to fist the cuffs? Okay, we continue this story. Let's see. There is only one way to defeat Artemisia. You must kill her in the future. There is nothing we can do unless we go to the future. No way to jump to the future under normal circumstances. But there is still a way. It is because Sorcerer's Artemisia plans to compress time. Compressing time with magic, what good will it do for the sorcerers to compress time? Yes. Yes, I get it. I get it. Sorceress Rhinoa. That's weird. Okay. Use Sorcerer's Rhino and inherit Ultimacia's powers. That sounds awful. Send Rhino back to the past with Ultimacia. You're blowing my mind right now. Stop. Ugh. Oh. Once Artemisia is in the past, she'll use the time compression magic. She'll cut Rhino and Artemisia off. Rhino will come back to this world, and Artemisia goes back to her own world. Time compressed world. Past, present, and future get mixed together. Um. Yeah, sure. I'll just take your word for it, man. I don't. I don't know what you're saying right now. You're just speaking in moon language. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it. That's fine. I don't get it. I'm with Laguna. Man, Ward's got a nice looking beard, man. See that fucking blonde chin strap he's got? It's nice. Colonel Sanders ass motherfucker. Alright. So we're gonna go to Lunatic Pandora. Rescue alone. Fight Adel. Rhino gets possessed. Yes! <laughs> well, if you didn't, we'd be fucked. Yes! That's the spirit. Brings back Rhinoa. Okay. Add to the future. Through compressed time. Far in the future where none of us can technically exist. There's only one way to make yourself exist in a world like that. Don't forget one another. As friends, believe in one another. Believe in your friend's existence. So, if you believe, it's the mind-body connection. If I believe, I can fly. If I believe, I can touch the sky. I can do it. I see. Flower fields. It's all about love, friendship, and courage. Never mind all the technical mumbo-jumbo. Love and friendship sounds corny, but everyone seems to be up for it. We'll try. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, his leg. It's acting up. Oh, he's wearing sandals? Oh, I hate him. I hate... I cannot stand that. Cover your feet, man. Jesus, or don't wear any shoes at all. Why even wear the sandals? What the fuck are they doing for you? Well, guys, it's time for so long. But we'll sing just one more song. Thanks for doing your part. You sure? Okay. Uh, no, seriously, it's time to say goodbye to Esthar and any other location, because in Disc 4, you can't go to them anymore. Disc 4 is complete endgame stuff, so no dicking around in towns. Here we go. Let's bust in there. Ready. Make a big hole. Boom. Oh shit. Splat. Oh, they got shield. Well, of course they would. You know what this reminds me of? Oh, she's excited. <laughs> she's stoked. Yeah, this reminds me of, like, when you're trying to, like, push your thumb through, like, a grocery bag or something, and you got that resistance of the plastic, but then eventually it breaks through. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it reminds me of. Then deploy my dragon sword hands. Man! Now, this is a fucking airship. The high wind looks like a piece of shit compared to the Ragnarok. Holy cow. Alright, uh, what? No. See you guys later. It's time to throw down Lunatic Pandora, baby. Let's do it. Alright, so we're about to fight a boss here. It's probably them, you know. Impossible. Hey, look, it's Ryzen and Fusion. Hand over Rhinoa. I'll never hand over Rhinoa. And we're taking a loan. I won't let you resurrect Adel either. <laughs> Man, you're demanding. Yeah, you're greedy. Holy cow. Let's go. Dude, we just busted through a wall with a dragon sword. We got six people in our posse. Do you really want to pick a fight? Don't you already know the result? Loss. That's the result. Okay. So, we're not going to mug anything. Oh, I forgot to put strength junction on there. My bad. We're not going to mug anything because he drops something better when you don't mug him. Fusion, uh, if you're a higher level, which we're not, will have full life. But she just has life, so. That's okay, also. You know, we're fine. Haste! Blind? Come on now. Stop dick. Yo, you blind the one that does 40 damage. Mm, not the best idea. Fuck out of here, eye patch lady. We got some strength ups, which is better than a power wrist. Power wrist is only strength plus 40%. I will only take hyper wrists. They're not through yet, though, so... I'm gonna put Encounter None on. Oh, it's already on. Okay. I'm gonna put Mug on, because we need that for the next battle anyways. So... Where are my eye drops at? Alright. 
I'm gonna keep Quistus' strength low so he can uh, mug without fear of killing anybody. Because the next battle we have to mug. Do a couple mugs. Muglets. Oh, Bigs and Wedge again? <laughs> Chose the wrong career. Ordered around by some punk. Why don't you quit? Just kidding, sir. You're right! I quit! Wedge is like, fuck. Let's go home and have a drink. <laughs> Me too? <laughs> Where are you guys going? What about our salary? <laughs> and he's just like, yeah! Hit the pub, man! Well, I got some bad news, guys. Time is about to be compressed. It's about to be compressed. So... Yeah. So, we've been here before. With Zell's team, and we remember we got blown away. This is the same place, Lunatic Pandora, right? So, if you forgot any items, you can always go back and get them here. Two. Alright, we don't want to go to two. We, we know nothing's in two. This might be three. Let's see. I don't know, though. I'm not sure. Whoa! Someplace. Man, that speed scroll thing really pissed me off. Gotta get a whole other speed scroll. Ugh. Down we go. Ugh. That drop point never came back. That's sad. Yeah, it would be like right here or something. I think like, look, it, like it wants to move here. Like there's a spot. So I think the hole would be right there. But we missed it like a fucking idiot. So... Save point. Save your game. In the club. You save your game. At the mall. Save your game. Alright. Time. To mug. A robot. Or at least... Robot helpers. We have a surprise, you know? So why didn't this just blow us away instantly? I don't... I don't get it. Hey, I still need your card, buddy. Like, I lost it. Weapon re-attack mode... On. Support. Okay, there's the probe. Alright, so we have to mug the probes. That's why she's so weak, is so we can mug safely. See it? There we go. Got two vid ups from the left. Oh shit. Oh shit. I didn't know that they, uh. Homing laser, what does this do? Oh, that's nothing. That's a joke. What is this? Oh my god! What a horrible, uh, fucking... Wow! Oh shit! You serious? What the fuck? Holy, what? Oh my goodness. Uh, let's use a Phoenix Pinion, because I don't know what it... I've never, ever seen 
Phoenix. And this will give you a good idea what it does. So after you use a Phoenix Pinion, Phoenix can randomly appear when your party's wiped out. This is what I understand it with. I don't know if we can kill these probes or not. But as you see, it brought, uh, pushed us back to life. And I think it healed us or something. So, randomly, uh, Phoenix will now come out when our party's wiped out. Kind of like Odin comes out randomly. Alright, we're just going to kill Mobile Type 8 because... Heat of Flame, what is this? Wow, man! Is this guy for serious? This guy wasn't joking around. Uh... Twin homing laser. I don't want to mug him, because he might drop a better item if I don't mug him. So... You dead yet, man? What the hell? Hey. Hey. So this is his counterattack, I guess. Which, it's whatever. He has that move that brings us down to one. So... Is this it? Okay. That, that Corona cor Corner... Whatever. That move that brought us down to one, he's supposed to use it when he dies. He's not supposed to use it just randomly. Wow, man. Well, we got to see Phoenix. Oh, we got a laser cannon. We already had one of those. That's okay. Which, by the way, I forgot to set my new GFs. Uh, or at least palm it. Learn summon magic. Fucking whatever. We need to make them learn... Uh, I don't know. Something. Rare item. Try that out. Okay, so we're going to forget HP 30 because he needs an extra slot to make sure he gets everything. Uh, okay, there it is. Because HP 40 is all he needs to have max HP. So Looks good to me. Okay. Actually, let's let's go back and tent it up now. I don't know if there's another save point, but if there is, uh... you know what? I could just keep Quistus and Critical. Um, where are the tents at? Would allow her to uh, let me see what could we use we could use mighty guard we could do that mm, okay Here we are. I wonder if we can mug anything from Cypher. Show him your hospitality. We've had enough, you know. Oh.
go. Okay. <laughs> Don't know what's right anymore. Thought we were a posse. Posse. Whoa. Oh, Fujin, you're not supposed to speak not in capitals. Whoa. We always will be. We want to help you. So is that all an act? She's getting all deep and philosophical. Been fun. And now it's time to smoke you. If you like this song, you can listen to my metal cover version of it. It's on my YouTube channel. The night is retired. Young revolutionary. I've always got to do something big. Okay. To the goal. He's not sharing the goal with me. What a jerk. At least he's back to old Cypher being a dumbass. Okay, so here comes Odin. Hey, this is the first time you've seen Odin, which is... Normally, you would have seen him many times cut people in half by now. And he will just come out randomly in battles and kill him instantly. But... In this case, uh, Cypher just... Cuts him in half, which is strange. And his sword goes flying into the sky. <gasps> Hand. Who could it be? You just killed Odin. You just held your sword out and he <laughs> split in half. Weird. I didn't think he was such a weakling. Um, what do you have? Crap. Mighty guard it up. Now what? So I think it gives us Aura. Aura has uh, the ability of giving you limit breaks whenever you want. Oh. Who's this? It's Gilgamesh. He's got Odin's blade. Gave me the fourth one. Was it you? Dodge my sword. Couldn't die to fucking tornado, bitch. See ya. <laughs> Where is the dimensional interval? So Gilgamesh is kind of this slightly comedic Final Fantasy character who carries a lot of swords and does a lot of weird moves associated with the swords. Hero, that also gives you the same effect as Aura. And Holy War does the same thing for every character. So, yeah. Not yet. Still not over. This guy won't give up, man. Cypher's got Rhinoa. God damn it. Okay.
Haven't you done enough? Wasn't he like your sweet 16 heartthrob? And now he's like holding you by sword point, feeding you to a sorceress. You guys have bad taste in men. There's our boy, or girl, Adel. I think it's a man. It look, come on. Must have been lost in translation. That can't be a woman. There's no way. Save your game. Guess. Oh, that's right. It's probably disc four, isn't it? Oh, shit. I forgot it came that early. I thought I was going to have to fight Adel before Disc 4. Oh, here's Disc 4. Squaresoft.com. Look at that URL. HTTP colon slash slash. Ah, 1998, 1999. Those were the days. Now we're in disc 4. It seems a lot like uh, disc 3. But whatever. Alright, let me see. Uh... What's up here? Break. Okay. That's cool. Guess we run up this thing. Where am I going? Okay, um, let's... I guess we'll keep Quistus in the, uh, critical. Yeah. That Mighty Guard seems pretty good. Save point, alright. Okay. Is it? Come on, that's not a woman. Nope. Doesn't even have a shirt on. Got like man packs, you know, like that's a do. Up. Now we gotta fight Adel with Rhinoa strapped to his her chest. We have to save Rhinoa. Let's go for Adel. I get it. Okay, let's use a little mighty guard here. Oh, he's gonna try and steal health from Rhinoa. So we can use actually something like a high potion we can use on Rhinoa and that would heal her up. I don't know how much health she has, but. God damn! Easy! Easy on the meteors! Holy cow, man. Mighty God! It didn't work at all, huh? For some reason, it did not work. I don't know what that's about. Well, whatever. I guess we're just gonna mug Adol. Oh, 
holy oh man he is using some fucking magic please stop this nonsense only 132 that's pretty good good and steel everyone's on healing standby where's my regular high potion there we go that's not gonna work I guess Mighty Guard did work, but we're not yellow. That's weird. We didn't turn all yellow. Trying to mug, uh. He's kind of. Oh shit! He dropped my frames. Look at this. Holy cow! Man, Quake is a frame dropper. Put in steel. You're driving me nuts. Oh my god, are you kidding me? At least we're getting to see all these high level spells. Let's cast this on Rhinoa. He's got region. So we can just cast region on right now. Let's give first a high potion. You're getting too many turns, buddy. I don't want to attack him, because... I'm trying to fucking get... Whatever I'm trying to steal from him, damn it. Come on! We can also mug uh, some Mega Elixirs from her, by the way. Jesus Christ, man, like, this is... All I want to do is mug... I could kill you right now, dude. You have no idea. I guess... Okay, finally. Alright. I'm gonna mug Rhino. I'm gonna try it. Oh wait, you know what? Squall also has uh Squall also has um What is this? What is this? Is this fucking Dragon Ball Z you just making up new balls of energy? Calling them different shit. Alright, we're she's pretty uh not damaging, so Where's high potion? Yeah, I get it. I get it. That's a physical attack because it brings up protect. Oh, there we go. You're done. You're done for. You're done. Let's go. I'm done with you. Oh, here comes that lag. That one frame a second. <laughs> Doink. Slice. I don't know how much health she has, so I'm just... done? Man, I had more trouble with uh, that robot, dude. Just from hits. Perspective. Adel has been vanquished.
the guy sorceress. That's what I'm gonna say because clearly a guy. Hey, Rhino, you're looking a little uh, woozily. What? Now's your chance. Use the life stream. Whoa. You did it. I guess. Time compression, let's do it. Love, friendship, and courage. That's where the game gets a little weird. Totally, man. We're skydiving. Skydiving through all these memories. Moments in time. I don't know. Into this uh, blob of Capri Sun. Let's go to Edia's house. Came out the other end of water. And we got swept up by some birds. And now, going through this tunnel of something. Looks kind of like Final Fantasy VII, the end of it, after beating Sephiroth. Yep. Alright. It's very white. <laughs> what the f Was that a joke? How do I save my game?